Okay, today we wanted to do a little bit of a demonstration on using a piece of software, a piece of assistive technology software uh, called WIN along with a special easy to set up portable scanner called Pearl from Freedom Scientific. And the goal is to see here if uh, Jack can easily take his homework textbooks, uh, scan in pages, and then have those pages read back to him uh, in an immersion reading kind of way. And so we thought we'd just like to demonstrate him doing that. Now today we have uh, this technology at home with us. We're actually on a trial basis with this technology and we're, we're just testing it over the weekend. So Jack has actually only used this software for probably about 20 minutes, which will also give you an idea of how easy it is to use. So, uh, why don't you go ahead and set it up and let's see how that works. Basically comes in a small bag a little portable bag and this is a USB device that requires no additional power and you can set it up on any flat surface okay and then he'll go ahead and plug it into his computer which he already has on this is just his laptop computer which he already has on and then he's going to go ahead and start up the Win software which will take a second to load and then he's going to go ahead and turn to um, a particular section of a social studies book that he has from school. And he's going to scan in one of the sections. Okay. So now what he's first going to do is, uh, this is a demo mode, and so he's going to go ahead and, and take it out of demo mode. Um, but then what he's going to do is it comes up with kind of a, uh, an initial open document that he closed and he so he went ahead and closed uh, closed that document and now he's going to proceed to go ahead and scan in uh, a reading assignment from his book and as he does this uh, the the actual scanner is actually a small camera that's mounted on this stand that you see on the desk and what happens is it does a snapshot of the page, reads that page in, and then the Win software actually does optical character recognition and converts it. Okay. I think this assignment was about seven pages or so, the one that he's scanning in. The delay that uh, that he has is from the software actually doing the conversion once he's uh, done the snapshot. A lot of that I think probably has to do with the speed of the computer. He has a pretty decent laptop computer, but um, it's also one that was uh, not real expensive, and so it doesn't have a huge amount of horsepower. Uh, but it but it is very it's a Windows 7 machine, and uh, it's certainly fast enough for what he's doing here. Okay, and I think he has a review and assessment pages, a couple that he's going to do here. And looks like, yeah, there's that page there. You can also see, too, I know it's uh, kind of hard to see the computer screen behind him, but as he does it, uh, he's actually seeing a real view of the uh, of the page that was taken and what the wind software will actually do then is he can go back and he can have this uh, these pages read to him either in looking just at the text or he can put it into the real view okay so now what he's going to do is he can go back to the very first page and I think if he goes over to yep and if he scrolls up to the very first page Okay, and then he can have it read to him. Apia A1, Section 3, the Pacific Islands Physical Geography. Prepare to read objectives in this section. You will 1. Examine features of high islands and low islands. 2. Learn about the Now he can stop the reading at any time by just clicking on the screen. And then if he wants to scroll down and if he clicks on another section, another word, he can start reading at particular points. 
Record your findings in it. Target reading skill. Identify main ideas. Sometimes the main idea in a paragraph or reading passage is not stated that. direct. And so the, the point is, we probably spent here, oh, that was maybe about five minutes. I've been standing here talking and videotaping this. And during that five minute time, he unpackaged the scanner, hooked it up, and he scanned, what, about seven or eight pages, Jack, would you say? About seven pages, wasn't it? Seven or eight pages seven. Uh, out of a textbook. Uh, so you can see really how quickly he can do it um, and how effectively then it can read back. Now, we still are in the process of testing the software. There's a lot of other things this software can do, including allowing you to highlight text. Uh, so he literally on the screen can highlight uh, important facts out of sections and, and probably quite a few other things. But you know, our main goal with this software has been to find something that would allow him to quickly scan anything he wanted to read and then do immersion reading, which is basically where uh, the text is both read to him and highlighted at the same time. So I think that completes our demonstration today.